Okay, now let us see the next form of assessment, which are called activity, I mean assessment of learning. We've seen the assessment for learning, now we are going to see assessment of learning. This is summative because we always give feedback to learners. It involves students in the learning process where they ask questions and then practice skills. Now you saw that we saw that in active in the assessment for learning, you guide them. You guide from one group to another as you guide them. Then when from there we come to the assessment of learning. Now after guiding these learners, now it's them to take part in their or to do the task you are giving them. So, in most cases now here, they are going to ask you questions as you give them feedback. Now they are the ones asking you about, after you giving them something, then they ask you, how should we do this? What happens after this? What happens after this? So now, but in most cases, all the work is being done by learners. So how to use assessment of learning, evaluating the learning process by observing the students now for you, you may just ask here is to observe as they are doing. As well, demonstrating their skills. Former teacher can capture a video here. You can capture a video that after this process, then you can pray for them and they see where they were, what they were doing, observing as you pray for them. You can even share with your colleagues. Correct written work and other learning products. So after the day, after because we said that we said you group them. Those groups, of course, they have been writing their findings. After that, then you correct them where. Engaging students in conversation to reveal their understanding and then capturing what they are, the teacher sees and hear digitally because we've been capturing a video. So here now, it's time for you to give the students to express themselves. What are, or how are they understanding their task? What have they been doing? Then there, it pushes us to assessment as learning. This, at the extent, and this looks at the external forces and sees that every learner is comfortable in class in consideration to learners' abilities and the surrounding environment. So this one is focused mainly at the comfort of the learners in that aspect. So how do you use assessment as learning? Now here, because here, remember, in activity, in activity of learning, I mean assessment of learning, we are affecting those things that have been doing in their groups. Now here, it's time now for you to harmonize. We call it harmonizing. What do you mean by harmonizing? After collecting all the ideas from different groups and then some people have presented, then you to give down them that this one we may take this point, this one we may take this at this point, this one we may take this at this point. And then after doing that, you allow them to make their own notes. And then after making their own notes, then they present to you that work. And then you see if what you gave them at last, at the end of the this one is mainly done at the end of towards the end of the lesson. And then you give them some work to do. But then they should make notes about that lesson. Okay, so then observing the groups to check the progress of the learning process. Of course, because you've corrected it, you know what group was presenting what. You go and then you see what happens. Now you are interacting with them slowly, slowly. Then giving challenge, giving us into different groups and availing them the resources. Now here you can give the exercises, activities for them to try after. Giving challenging activities to learners to check on their Abilities, skills, values, and attitudes during the learning process. Of course, you, don't, you give them extra questions which require extra thinking from those who have been doing their lessons so that you allow them to go a step further. Then, triangulation this is the triangle, so which is simply the COP. You're acting as a COP. What do you mean by COP? You converse with the students, but conversing with an intention. Then observing what they are doing as they are doing their own work. Then the products, what are they giving you after the whole process? Then this is how the teacher can collect the evidence from learners. And then you can know that ah, this group, something is wrong. This one, this one needs to change. So this one, trying to see what is the process by which teachers collect evidence about students' learning. 
just converse with you know when you're conversing with someone or in a given group you can get their ideas and then as they are telling you you know that this one is happening this is happening or you can observe and then it's like this group is doing something but it's not that okay or from their product you can say ah this group has presented a nice 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 work they when they from the product they are giving you then Teachers' conversation should be intentional and planned so that really, so when you are talking to them, you should be talking with an idea. So why am I talking? Why am I telling? Why am I telling them this? Why am I okay with that intention? During the conversation, the teacher looks for the learning skills, present the learning skills like innovation, problem solving, creativity. How is someone answering the question you have been giving him or her in terms of? I mean the conversation we've been having. In learners, which will come out as the product. The product should be kept for future reference. So now after they are giving you this, keep them because you are going to be monitoring these students individually sometimes. So that's it. Now we are going to see what we call the activity of integration and lesson. As we said, you can change the video. You go to you click in the video, you click in those three dots. Then you go to advanced settings, then you can see the quality of videos, then you choose the one you want, and then the quality will improve. That's it. I wish you well, but please don't forget to subscribe to the channel.